There you go. She's too smart for you. She cut you off. Uh oh. Get him, Rox. I don't know. I guess I'll have to go do all kinds of fun stuff on my own. Whoa. Oh, there he is. Yeah, oh. yeah, yeah, yeah. In a shocking turn of events, Clark Man is sick for the third time now in his 10 weeks at school. He's got a cold, and as a result of that, he gets to do something that he hates to do, and that's have some cough syrup, which is why he's hiding behind me right now. Most kids would just drink this out of here for Clark Man because he's a big baby. I got to pour it in here. And then I mix it with like a little bit of something else that way he can't taste it because he hates the taste of it. Don't be scared, boy. It's for your own good. <laughs> nice job. You're gonna feel better. My book. I got you. <laughs> Somewhere right. there. Oh no, your head's on the outside. No. Oh my gosh. This is this is complicated. I love you. You have a great day, buddy. Yeah. Love you. Another day, another bus. Welcome everyone to Home Alone with Greg. I'm going to get the uh, stove ready to hopefully be taken out of here. Face off. I know we've got a couple things being stored in this region down here. Dude. Oh my god, that melted. That melted to the bottom of that. That's crazy. This whole setup is super sketch. They actually have the floor cut out where the feet of this are. I'm hoping, I don't know if that's the whole way back or just right there, but they did that so this would line up perfectly and it's like a nice little ledge there. Hopefully the new one works with that and hopefully you don't see this. That's like super sketchy though. Luckily the new one doesn't have this it just kind of sits in there so it can be up higher or lower a little bit i suppose we've been having a bad run with stuff here at the house lately the dryer over the summer recently the washer delivered this week now this they say that home ownership is the american dream i don't know about that it's kind of an expensive thing sure it's nice having a place that's yours that you can do whatever you want with but it sure is nice and i remember back in the day like when we lived in our apartment we had an issue with a washing machine for example I made a phone call and I was like, hey, there's an issue with the washing machine. It was someone else's problem. But yeah, now everything's my problem, whether it's a washing machine, a dryer, needing a new mattress, repairing an oven, getting scammed on an oven, putting a new oven in, it's all on me. It should be good though. What else could happen? Shouldn't say that. Furnace explodes. Water starts pouring from the roof. The guys are here. They did the best they could with what they had. Unfortunately, our old stove, the sizing of it, required this piece of countertop to be back here. This stove is its too big for that. So it's currently sitting at a very uh, weird angle here, a little bit, because that needs taken out. So I called my guy that does countertops, and I'm hoping that we can just get that removed and this slid back and all is right with the world. When that's going to happen, I have no idea. Cody's coming home shortly. Then we're going out tonight. She has to do a little bit of shopping. We have to get some sheets for the new mattress that we bought. It's just a never ending thing. We're gonna go out for dinner to Olive Garden. Clark Man loves that place. He's been wanting some chicken yonkey soup, which is his favorite thing there. And I think that's it. I forgot about the other thing we're doing today. Getting our furniture reupholstered, or at least taking it in. Clark Man! Wait a minute, wait a minute. Get over here. My, what? <laughs> we made some stuff. We made some stuff. Wow. Okay. We did a dice thing where we we have to put stuff on our turkey, and um, I got I got to put glasses on our turkey. Oh. Because I went into six, so I got a turkey. Turkey glasses. I got bad news, Clark man. Roxy turned into a pile of cushions. Um, what's all the, what do we do with all this stuff, huh? We're going to try to turn it back into Roxy Bear. No, I'm serious. Oh, we're going to take it in to get it reupholstered. Oh, uh, fell apart? No, just uh, new well, fabric. Yeah, it's it's kind of, nice. they're all hand-me-downs and they're stained. Or discolored. Not really like they're stained. They're just hideous. Eh. 
Ooh, I found the fabric. Hello. Right there. Hello. How are we doing? Good. How are you? Good. Just set her down there. All right. We got so some things. Full sets. Yep. Yeah. Two, two chairs. So everything back here, left, right, and center. Up and down each aisle by color. Yeah. For like a navy blue or like a okay. slate blue. blue. Sure. Let's go back here in this section. Here, navies and slates here. Okay. The back wall also. Okay. And we could choose any of these then. Anything you want. Okay. Yeah, anything you want. Just all upholstery fabric. Let's find one that feels real nice. That's a little too blue. That's like uh, denim. Yeah. Too light. Mm -hmm. Nothing on this rack that I'm liking. Ooh. Yeah. How's that feel? That's kind of nice, eh? Mm -hmm. I could just cut a piece? Is that what he said? Yeah, he was like, just cut a corner off of it. Let's wait until we have one figured out that we want. Right. Yeah, buddy. Yeah. I think I found one that feels soft. That's so soft. Feel that. Oh, yeah. That feels glorious. It's real nice. Yeah, that's like rock. Let's get this. That looks like it would match everything. Oh, this one's perfect. No. No? Okay. okay. I'm surprised you don't like that one. That seems... I kind of like it. But... You like geometric shapes, too? I do. This would be good for Clark Man's room, but I feel like it's too... This one. No, I don't like that one. I like this one. I see you. <laughs> I don't like that one right there. This right. one's okay. How about this? They're saying this is a slate roof gray. I kind of like that more than... That's my favorite one thus far. Mm -hmm. So it's timeless. For sure. But patterns... You're uh, stuck. Yes. Sometimes I like them and then I get sick of them. Yeah. I hear you. Oh, that's the one that was kind of green, isn't it? Yeah, that's the one I've This seems about. more classy to me. It's weird. It changes color on camera. It looks purple on camera. Eh. But it's definitely blue. You look at it against your... Mine's a navy blue coat. Now it looks gray. <laughs> it's really it's doing weird gray. stuff. And then against yours... It changes want, on camera. We want like bluish gray. Let's see okay. what it looks like yeah. compared to that. Oh yeah. I think that'll match the hue in our, in our Now it looks, walls. it looks blue there, eh? Yeah. You yeah. can't tell the difference. It's pretty good. Yeah, if you're going back and forth, just depends where yeah. it's at. Fabric acquired. $170 to do two chairs. I was just thinking it was going to be twice that. Yeah. What else can we buy for the house and spend money on? <laughs> Let's go. I missed the story. I'll tell the story if you don't tell it. I can't like repeat myself. It was too good not to have. Okay, so Cody's student, one of them today, asked what her husband does for a living because she looks yes. rich, supposedly. <laughs> and she didn't want to say that I had a YouTube channel. So what'd you tell him? So I, I said what you used to do and you felt like you were selling your soul to the devil. Right. Because you're giving loans to people who really couldn't afford what'd them. What'd you tell him what I do didn't now? feel like morally good about it. And um, I just said the... No, they're the ones that mentioned, what is that? They're the ones that mentioned that, um, so he just stays at home. And I said, yeah. And then they're like, what does he do? And I said, he has hobbies he's into. So she basically <laughs> said I'm a deadbeat. <laughs> I didn't say you were a deadbeat. You said that I don't have a job anymore because I quit <laughs> and I stay at home and I do my hobbies. So he plays games all day. That I is mean, what you do. I you do. say it yourself that you turned your hobby into a living. You didn't say that I do my hobby for a living. Then they probably would have asked more questions. You said I'm a deadbeat, basically. I didn't call you a deadbeat. I mean, you didn't lie to him, though, either. No, I didn't. He has exactly. a lot of... I do my hobbies for... I, I just answered how I needed to answer <laughs> without lying and not oh. being forthcoming with more information. He has hobbies. He <laughs> <laughs> was the breadwinner for a little while there. What? I was. Are you when you first started YouTube... Oh yeah, that's true. I took a cut. I believed in myself. I believe in you too. Oh. <laughs> I don't feel like a deadbeat anymore. <laughs> it's probably good that we come to this place now because it's going to get nutty here after Black Friday. Clark, we can go toy hunting in here, buddy. <laughs> Sir? Come along, Cedric. Cedric? Come along, Cedric. Yeah, I just left my foot off the brake. I'm not gonna catch a cold on top of your cold. <laughs> a cold on your cold. Welcome to PJ's. I haven't been here in a while. It's super creepy. I'll put your teddy bear. He reaches it. You got Thanos. There's only dinosaurs over here. This is kind of neat. The little log home with 
furniture inside. Yeah, it looks like you. What's really going on here? We're a robotic dinosaur. Right now. And then we got all Ooh. these, look at all these cars. Boot Lego Hot Wheels. Yeah, that's Hot Wheels. Big time. I like this. Oh, you can build that? It says assembly line. Oh, these toys suck. Wheel bots, almost transformers. Is that Optimus Prime's broke brother? <laughs> no, for Optimus Prime. Oh, I'm from Masha. Get away from me. Uh, no. Yeah. Oh man, nice demo there, Clark man, of the busy race and drop tower. Clark and I just did a Lego video, or what would be a part of a Lego video possibly on my next project. How bad is it? The city project mecca. I just couldn't resist. It's terrible. Where is it? We'll find out. What's he think about this situation? Oh. <laughs> there you are. How bad is it? How bad is it? Oh, okay. Our next project. Our room is kind of gray with like a... Uh, like a purple tinge to it. Yeah, that kind of looks like that. Yeah, it does, something. doesn't it? Yeah. yeah, it does have like a purple. That's perfect. I feel like it, yeah. That was very painless. Delicious. <laughs> the best. Give it a whirl. They're too cute to eat, mm -hmm. but we must. We got some chocolate, we got some chips, we got some bedding. Successful day here at TJ Maxx. We were trying to steal, okay. but we got honest at the last minute. Thank you. Have a good night. We're good. Thank you. Yay, we're not thieves. On the way home, you can take a nap using those pillows. Napa. When you hear your family. He says, I was gonna do my gaming a watch, but let's write instead. Ooh, leftovers. <laughs> nice. I want is nearly 2,000 calories. So oh, that's, yeah. That's a no. <laughs> Make it two. Our waiter is fantastic here. We got ourselves a couple of drinks. We got the spiked strawberry lemonade, and you got the strawberry uh, lemonita. Is that what it is? I didn't get anything special. I got lemonade. It is special. It is special. Everything's special. Let's yeah, try this like out. I feel like we are we're on vacation. Oh, here. you can have some of this. There's no alcohol in it. That's pretty good. That's not alcohol. Yeah. I love it. Yours is way tastier. Mm -hmm. And such a freaking. Yeah, that's really sweet. And you get a strawberry with it. Mm -hmm. Instant win. It looks like it's a, an adult drink. What if you took the ice out of there? There's probably like that much in there. I like yours though. I think yours is way sweeter and very good. The breadsticks are fabulous. Oh my fabulous. god. Those no, breadsticks are amazing. Look at the butter on that. Yonky. Mark and his yonky. Mm -hmm. He's a cheap date here at Olive Garden. That's a yummy double cheeseburger. He's <laughs> just like, I want some yonky soup. <laughs> and then he eats his yonkies. Mm -hmm. Oh my goodness. Oh there? my goodness. Mm -hmm. Oh my goodness. Mm -hmm. Thank you very much. Yeah. You're very welcome. Have a good rest of your night. You too, man. Thanks. Okay. You call it kindergarten. Yeah. You call this kindergarten and you call the hotel show and tell. Yeah. <laughs> All right. That's a wrap for our day. We're going to go home, watch some Survivor, enjoy our Friday evening in a nice warm home.